reporting from Elixard at 408 Broad Street, Nevada City. Hello, Nevada City, Grass Valley. Uh, my name is Coulter Merrick. Uh, I'm the owner and operator of Elixard uh, Tea Bar, Art Gallery, and Raw Food. Essentially what you're looking at here is a really special collection of local artists uh, that changes very frequently. Um, we also have a full collection of teas over here on this side uh, that are all for sale. Um, we've developed a really special exotic elixir menu uh, with some very unique beverages that uh, I think are, are definitely worth a visit. Um, one that's gotten really popular is our Aunt Soda. We also do uh, a matcha mojito in the summertime. We're going to be making some really special saffron shilajee lattes amongst uh, many other things. We also have an amazing raw food bar and raw food chef. I can here uh, with a full menu. Um, we do food pairings with, uh, with, with special tea that uh, really create a sensual experience around the palate. Um, we also have events and a really neat social scene that happens on Friday nights, Saturday nights with live music, and uh, Kava Cacao, which is our popular event right now, Friday. It's $10 all-you-can-drink Kava, which is a Polynesian Pacific Island beverage that brings a state of well-being and, and euphoria, feel-good kind of drink that creates a good social atmosphere. The Cacao is another uh, local beverage that started up. It's a liquid chocolate drink that has a stimulating effect. Together they work really well to uh, create a really fun night for a lot of people. Um, I invite you guys to come on out. Uh, we also showcase a lot of local jewelry and, and uh, you know other local um, artists uh, in a few different forms. We're, um, we're also an event space and open for private parties and private events, birthdays, wedding receptions. Uh, we can cater events uh, in your home. We can uh, do tea service for you in your home. Um, I really invite you guys to come on down and check it out. It's a very unique, um, amazing new business in Nevada City. Trying some Wei Fei Taiwanese High Mountain Oolong today. A few steps here. Chill the tea here a little bit. And the reason for doing that? This is to warm the vessel, to keep the uh, Wei Fei means, means the very best, the beauty. And uh, this tea was actually um, developed, uh, got its name also from a village that was uh, ravaged by uh, earthquake. And they basically abandoned the, uh, the tea plantations and um, later came back to it and um, 
roasted the tea in a special way, uh, and um, it was a very prized tea. They kind of named it, coined it, Gui the, the beauty, the best. And uh, so that's basically what this tea is. It's a roasted oolong, um, moderate oxidation level, about 40%. Um, so it has some darker notes to it. But when you uh, roast the tea after after it's been prepared, it brings out some of the sugars. So you get some of those plum notes, some of those citrus notes. Um, very unique uh, for uh, for an oolong tea. Reporting with the union, this is Jennifer Turman.